See you in a bit. Hunting in Wisconsin state parks has always been strictly controlled. Now the DNR wants to loosen the rules. So what do hunters and park lovers have to say about that? Keller Russell is live in Waukesha with their stories. Keller. And Carol and Stephen, communities all around the state, people gathered tonight to voice their opinions on expanding hunting in state parks. Here in Waukesha County, there are passionate feelings on both sides. Kind of spooks you out knowing that there might be people shooting a gun. Jim Waltz and his wife love spending time outdoors and in Wisconsin's various state parks, but he has mixed feelings about sharing the space with hunters. Mainly, he's concerned about safety. And you don't know where the bullet's going to go. A new state law allows people to hunt and trap in certain state parks and state trail areas. They can be within 100 feet of trails, campgrounds, and picnics. The state's Natural Resources Board scaled back on when the hunting was allowed by law, but that could soon change. You know, the vote, outcome of the votes and base our decisions accordingly. An advisory group to the DNR known as the Wisconsin Conservation Congress took a survey from the public on whether they support expanded hunting in state parks to more than seven months out of the year. Bow hunter Jeff Perlowitz favors the idea. There's areas away from the high traffic of the trails from the hikers across country skiers that hunting could be available, especially for bow hunters. But not everyone who uses the parks agrees. Well, there's major safety risks involved here. And once again, these are public lands. We all pay for them. It is not land for 10 percent, it's land for 100 percent. Now the vote taken tonight is not final. Rather, the results will be forwarded to the legislature and Natural Resources Board as a strong recommendation. Live in Waukesha County, Keller Russell, today's TMJ4. Definitely have not heard the last of this. Thank you, Keller.